in English um, and sing it with all you together. So as you guys listen along, as you guys try to sing along, I would really encourage you guys to um, look at the lyrics and try to mean it as you guys sing it. And um, yeah, let's just look at, take a look at it. It goes like this. Till the second coming of the Lord, I will trace your steps in one accord. Narrow gate, narrow way, with the cross of
for this time. And I would like to ask you to pray the first for all the guest speakers that we have to other conferences. If you would pray for them to fill, uh, to ask God to fill them with the Holy Spirit, that their words may be as powerful as uh, the sword of, of God, so that it may pierce through our hearts, and that we may be challenged and encouraged together at the same time. That you will, that their words will be your word, um, and that they may be healthy physically and spiritually, and that they may um, be used by God to for for the kingdom. Uh, for the kingdom of God, for its expansion, and that the Balkans may return to God again, and that the revival may come again through all of us together here at this place. So if you would pray for the guest speakers today at this moment, and I'll lead you continuously for the next prayers. Let's pray together for the guest speakers. Father God, we want to pray and lift up our guest speakers at this moment, Father. We have lots of passion coming from all different kinds of places. Father,
Father God, we are gathering here as your people. Coming from different kinds of places, uh, taking a long trip over here to Montenegro, you have allowed us to have this conference, and we do want to give thanks to you for that. It is by your will and by your desire that we have been gathered here from many places. We give glory, we give honor, and we lift up your name. Thank you for using us, Father. Thank you for using us as your instruments to expand your kingdom. Thank you for using us as your servants to serve other people. And thank you for using us as your messengers to deliver the gospel to all the people around this world. Father, we are still weak and we still need lots of strength in our lives. And we confess that we cannot do anything without you. So Father, we ask you again to strengthen us, not only during this conference, but continuously every day, so that we may not fall short and that we may not be able that we that we won't be discouraged but be motivated and be able to continue to do your work with perseverance with patience and with the power of the holy spirit father thank you so much for all the pastors here for all the church leaders for the church members uh, we ask that you will bless each of them and also allow them to have a good rest as they stay here. And as we continue to pray to you throughout the retreat, uh, we ask that you will listen to us and that you will speak to us as well. Um, so Father, our ears and hearts and minds and eyes are all open towards you. So receive it, accept it, and give us also your input towards us. Thank you once again for the gathering here. And we pray this all in Jesus' name. You can have a seat.